What is going on guys, it's Armada And today we will actually be talking about the World War II screenshots Now I have gathered quite a few of them but I don't think I actually got all of them If I did miss some screenshots make sure you guys tweet me the image or you could just tell me in the comment section below Make sure you guys tell me if I did miss some But this is going to be all the World War II zombie screenshots and i'm going to be talking over it and just telling you guys what i think now before we actually get started in seeing all these screenshots <clears throat> i want to let you guys know that the zombie community is in a bit of a weird place and so we're not really getting any intel of infinite warfare zombies or world war ii zombies so there's nothing really to make a video about and if you guys do have any recommendations on what to do make sure you guys leave that in the comments but yeah guys let's get started in seeing the world war ii screenshot the first screenshot we got is one that we already seen and I already made a video about this I just wanted to get this one out of the way so I just put it first and it's and it's a picture of the zombie I made a whole dedicated video about this picture and so we already know this I shouldn't be talking about it it's just July 20th that's when we were gonna get the zombies news but let's just go the next picture is a pretty gruesome picture so we can see like a spine or something something very gruesome i'm pretty sure it's a spine and it has a lot of gore and i'm so happy to see this in world war ii zombies because infinite warfare as we all know did not have this super dark gory feeling in the actual game mode and i'm so happy to see that world war ii is finally going back to the old gory zombies and i'm so happy but yeah we're gonna get a lot of these gory images like this one right here it shows like a zombie's brain and some mechanical parts attached to it to make the zombies like i don't know crazy but we can see like a black brain or something and it's just a lot of gore and i'm so happy to see that I, at least that's what i think it is i actually think it's a brain but let, let's go on the next one we see is another spine picture, and there's really not much to say other than this looks pretty gruesome. World War II zombies, I love ya. And yeah, it actually look, kind of looks like me. And by the way, most of these tweets actually get pretty, pretty good likes just because of how much people love to see these pictures, and I love to see them too. It's just really brings up the hype by looking at these pictures i love it so much the next picture we actually see is of a zombie and it was kind of a recent it was a recent picture of a zombie and in the tweet it said i see you and they put this picture of the zombie with its completely white eyes and looks spooky as hell it's so gruesome i cannot wait to see that dark feeling even the zombies alone look scary i don't know what happened to his nose um, I don't know what happened to his mouth, but hey, it's a zombie, so, um, yeah. The next picture we got is the zombie's eyes. Now, I don't know what the tweet said with this. I just found it and took it. You guys probably already noticed that the zombie's eyes are going to be completely white with little red veins inside them, and that looks pretty freaky. It looks like the zombies is possessed by some demon or something. The next picture we got is pictures that we saw inside the trailer and it's actually laying down on this wooden floor wooden table we don't know what it is but it's actually laying down somewhere on a wooden platform and it's just there and we it's in like in a file place and it's a zombie's face covered in some sort of sheets or leather or something it's really really interesting and then there's also another one that has a zombie and the back side is open it's it's pretty weird and then the last little other picture is of a zombie's face and there's little needles poking inside the hit. We can clearly see that there's experiments on these zombies as we saw in the trailer. Which makes a pretty good story already. I would 
say it's a pretty good story. The next picture we got is of a zombie that's just screaming with those little mechanical parts on it. I don't think this is going to do much. I just think this is there for design, but the mechanical parts can be used to make these zombies be harder to kill. Maybe that's the reason or maybe it's just for design. Let me go know what you guys think in the comment section below, but I think it is just for design. The next picture I'm so happy to see, but I've never seen this picture in my life and I'm so happy to see it. But it is actually our four characters, which if you guys didn't know is two guys and two girls, which is pretty different because we usually only get like all males and we also might get all males but one female but now we're actually getting two females and one male which is pretty interesting and we could also see this town they are in i think they're in germany or something i didn't read the bio of it but it's so interesting and i love seeing that picture anyways the next picture is in some sort of bunker or something and we can see a zombie with the mechanical parts attached to it. There's not really much to say here other than there's a bunch of chains and hooks in this area that the zombie's in. The next picture is uh, kind of the similar picture as we got, but it's clearly from the trailer, but in like a mirrored way. But I definitely remember seeing the zombie in the trailer. So there's really not much to say because it actually looks like a previous screenshot that I already covered in this video. So. The next picture is of this zombie and we can actually get a better look of the map in the background and it seems to be that they're not underground they're actually in the normal ground as we can see there's little houses in the background the next screenshot we got is of a zombie and we can clearly see that it has additional parts to it and i already already talked about this the white eyes the ugh, so and yeah super exciting stuff now the next one is actually kind of interesting because screws are actually attached to the zombie now i don't know why but i i'm getting this feeling of different types of zombies which is pretty interesting but also i kind of don't want it because the only time we actually got different types of zombies were in advanced warfare zombies which is exo zombies and People didn't really like them, and I'm really hoping that they could do this well. And our final one is actually of this little pipe going inside a zombie, which looks pretty... I, I don't even know how to explain this, but there's a rather a lot of blood and some gore. It looks pretty freaky. So, there really isn't much to talk about this photo because we already seen the spine shit. And I decided to throw this one in there because it's not really a screenshot, but hey, it's actually drawn from somebody that's working on the zombies that Glenn Scopefield and tweeted out and it looks pretty cool. He's a very good artist and he drew this World War II zombie, so I might as well just add that to the little picture in there. Rather freaky and I'm really hoping that this zombie actually makes it in World War II zombies. But yeah guys, that's all the screenshots I got. And if you guys see a screenshot that I have not mentioned in this video, make sure you guys tell me in the comments below. And also tell me what you guys want me to do is in a bit of a weird place. So yeah, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Let me know you guys enjoyed this type of content. And also make sure to check out my Twitter link down in the description below along with my Instagram. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace. Bittersweet heat is suffocating I'm waiting and always hesitating Kryptonite desires set my heart afire